Our Teacher of the Week, sponsored by Casey Carpet One. Joining me are Kyle. Congratulations on being our Teacher of the Week. Thank you very much. Yes, and of course Shelby here representing Casey Carpet One. So thank you all so much for being here today. Thanks for having us. So before we meet you and get, the, get to the awards, I want to read something. I want to nominate one of my amazing teachers. Mrs. Kyle Miller is our family consumer science teacher and does a phenomenal job of introducing real world and relevant life experiences into her classroom. Her scholars have an opportunity to learn how to sew. They learn about health and wellness through nutrition and culinary arts, and they always enjoy the flower baby experience. We're gonna to get to that in a minute. This is just a small snippet of their experiences. She also makes them she lets them go to Hardwick Elementary School where they read to students and do other projects with the kids. She was our Teacher of the Year last year and continues to set the bar extremely high for our scholars. I truly believe she is worthy of this recognition. Dr. John Martinez, your principal. So, yes. wow, how does that make you feel? <laughs> It feels, makes me feel appreciated. Mm -hmm. um, I do work really hard, and so it's nice when people recognize that. And I mean, I do it all for the kids. I love it every day, and every day is different, and so mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's a fun challenge every day. Yes, because you're about to make me cry. Let's get to this. Uh, w what is the flower baby experience? Tell us what that is. Um, so they have a five to ten pound sack of flour that we cover in um, like duct tape and tape and stuff, and then they name their baby and they carry it around for three to four days, um, and they treat it kind of like their baby. They take it to class with them. When they go to PE, they're not allowed to take it out to the gym. So we have a daycare set up mm -hmm, in the library mm -hmm. that the librarian puts on for them. And teachers kind of have daycare sometimes in their classrooms for the baby. And then when they're in my class, we learn how to swaddle. We learn how to put a diaper on the baby. We talk about different nutrition for the baby, different options. Mm -hmm. um, and so they kind of do a baby food taste testing right, too. Right. And now that's that a real stuff. life experience right there, <laughs> Shelby. <laughs> <laughs> I love that, I love that. So tell us how long you've been teaching. We know you teach at McKenzie, but tell us a little yes. bit about that. Um, this is my 12th year total. Mm -hmm. I've been at McKenzie for four years now, but 12 years altogether. Okay, great. So when did you know that you wanted to be a teacher? Um, ever since I was little and saw the movie Matilda, I wanted to be a <coughs> excuse me. I wanted to be a teacher like Miss Honey. Yes, I'm, I'm glad you said Miss Honey because there was another <laughs> option. But I'm glad. You yes, <laughs> Miss Honey. Yes. Yeah, so, and I thought I wanted to do kindergarten at first. And in high school, I did a program where I got to spend a day in classrooms and spent a day in kindergarten classroom, and it was exhausting. So props to all the kindergarten <laughs> teachers. I can't do that. And so then I knew I wanted to do some older grades. And so That's great. then through observations in college and stuff, I kind of, of figured course. out middle school. Give us one one tip that you have advice for any new teachers or those wanting to be um, a teacher. Consistency is very important and building a relationship with your students, mm -hmm. um, letting them know you're there for them and what to expect every day when they come into your classroom and that it's the same thing wow. every day. Fantastic. Well, Shelby, once again, you get to follow that, yes. say something, and of course present the awards. I know. I love that though. I think consistency <laughs> is important in all of our everyday lives. So mm -hmm. here is this award for you. I'm here on behalf of Casey Carpet One to give you this gift card. Um, just we appreciate everything that you do so much. So keep up all of your hard work and um, congratulations. Thank you very much. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I love that. So again, from us here at Trends and Friends, from Casey Carpet One, Teddy Jackson Ikes, congratulations on being our Teacher of the Week. We are so excited that we got to celebrate you and hear such kind words about you. Thank you very much. Absolutely.